Now, when you don't have a lot of space, you don't need to decide whether you're going to grow flowers or whether you're going to grow vegetables because you can mix the two. Now, peppers, and this is a nice dwarf green pepper plant. When you read the plant tags at the nursery, you can read whether vegetable starts are going to be dwarf or compact varieties or whether they're going to be larger. So here's a dwarf pepper plant, and I'm planting it with my flowers because whenever you have a brick planter box or a raised bed, it absorbs heat and heat-loving plants like tomatoes and peppers and basil, they're going to mature quicker. Now one question I get a lot is how do you fertilize when you have vegetables and flowers in the very same bed? Well just use an all-purpose plant food. I use Osmocote because it's slow release and you only have to apply it once in the growing season. Just sprinkle it into the soil, work it in a little bit, and you're done. It's just that simple.